Yo, what's good, YouTube? We got DDG surprising Haley with a hundred thousand dollar vacation for her birthday. Hit that sub button. Let's get to the video. What's good, job, man? Back to phone vlogging. Why did I say that? Currently in Orlando. I'm about to go to um. I'm gonna go to Disney World. Have a cool little time. Yeah. And I'm finna go to my hometown, Jamaica. I ain't even know You're I was going Jamaica. Going to Jamaica, man. Everybody, you know my Everybody so, to my a brother, blood clot guy. My brother that got me from the airport. Bullet. Bullet. So. Mm. Brought the Lincoln out today. It'd be cool though, yeah. I ain't get no sleep, man. I just came from uh, this nigga funky, bro. Austin, Texas, it was only like a two hour flight, so I got two hours of sleep on my belt. I gotta get back though, man. My sleep schedule all messed up. I ain't gonna hold y'all. Mm -hmm. The game when getting on the plane, stay Duh. up. You can just go to sleep on the plane. Excuse me, Doug. <laughs> Doug. Oh, where are we going? <laughs> they happen to take you to Coronado Springs. Oh, okay. That's like, you know where, though? You itinerary? That's what you, where you're supposed to go to? Yeah. Okay, that's fine. Okay, Dub. Dub got the hook up in this car. Hmm? I said, who up going to be there? No, I don't know who's there. Okay. Nah, who up going to be there? All right. You'll see that. Okay. Walk might be Surprise there. Lady. Little Walk might be front. up in there. Okay. Somewhere. She want me to call her before I get there, so she. Okay. Okay. Right, but. No, mm. talking to you. Talk. Really Are they going to hate me? For something that so far only exists privately in your mind. the mermaid, man. She. A lot okay. more people rooting for yeah. me than against me. Yeah. But the right. naysayers, those who were negative, were loud. Very loud. And so the first time in my life there was negativity targeted deliberately towards me because I looked different than the original character. And there were days when I thought, Hey man, why they hate no, no Haley because she playing as a black mermaid, a man? Coat. And it is something for it's you to think about, okay? Who are you? Yeah, who myself. are you? Who are you? Yeah. You need to ask yourself. Whether someone is supportive or not, do you know who you are? Did I accept this role for all good things? Do I see it as a blessing? Did Rob Marshall, the film's director, make the right decision in casting me? In making a historic casting for an iconic role? I think Haley really wanted to let her black side out for a minute. She wanted to turn up on him. You can see it. She like, how dare you? I dare you people not let me be the mermaid. I'm the black mermaid. I'm Disney. Y'all niggas gonna watch this. Watch it. Y'all seen the trailer? Nah, why they hate you, man? She the black mermaid. Let her be the black mermaid. Why they hate you? Just because the mermaid got a little melanin. Oh. And all the answers sense, were yes. Man. And those yeses started drowning out all the no's that I to I girl. And in the end, the loudest voice in your head should be yours and those of the people who love you and I'm who sorry, love and respect you. Simple but effective. I'm sorry, who bro. Am I? She glowing. My name is Hallie Bailey and yeah. I am a winner and a dreamer. Yeah. Give me some shit for it's kind of hard, it's ugly, mom. but it's hard. Sixty dollars in Zars is crazy. I thought y'all supposed to be cheap. Oh my god, I'm spending yeah, my man, money, my cheap. Niggas talking. Stand still over your number, you're not gonna feel a thing. They're all clear. Great.
Yeah. Okay. Excited to do. Just did the Avatar ride. I ain't recorded because could. I ain't gonna hold y'all, man. I'm usually no, scared of roller coasters, but I, I've been wanting to ride some roller coasters lately. I don't know what it is. I want to go to a music park. I don't know what it is. Pandora. Just got done doing the Avatar ride. I'm Avatar ride. So I don't know how to it's walk over there, man. I'm getting nervous. <laughs> this is a nice camera. That nigga getting nervous. Only That's what I think, man. I, I think. I think I'm gonna go glizzy this time, but I ain't gonna lie to you. Glizzy gobbler? Cheeseburger pie, I don't know about glizzy that. Glizzy gobbler. I just look like the most promising one. What y'all think? What would y'all order? Comment below right now. Thank you. <laughs> cheeseburger pie. They got cheeseburger pie? That's what that is? I thought it was like a little roll or something. Hamburger so good. Hey, that's probably helpful. Ooh. You got anything? That's good. <laughs> they look, he look like twins. That's kind of cool. 10 out of 10. W thumb. Spicy. Seasoning, good flavoring. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Better. So sweet. Oh, uh, <laughs> oh yeah. And it's vegan. It's going to be a lot safari? of opportunities for photos along the safari. I'm going to do my best to give you guys the best views possible. At times, we're not going to be able to stop for every single animal just by positioning of them. Uh, so do you recommend having those cameras or the video out ready to go? All right, safari time. Safari time. Uh, that is a really cool animal. Up until about a hundred years ago, they were thought what to be a myth it? everywhere outside of their Yo, habitats. That, that it's is mostly it. thought to be because of their strange appearance. <laughs> And because of that, they were mainly studied by cryptozoologists. Is that a, the people who study uh, mythological That's creatures. a zebra? They actually talk Can quite a bit class, about that. Can one question? Is she going to wear this accent? Males and females will not travel together Is that a zebra? Season, but they need a way to find each other. And for that, the females have scented hooves. They'll leave a trail behind so for the males to track and follow. They're actually pretty well known for their long oh my God. tongues as well. The word prehensile means they can use it to grab and usually referring to food. But in the Okrapi's case, they will also use it to clean out their own ears and eyeballs. Oh. On the hill on the right hand side, there's two different antelopes. That tan colored one, that is the greater kudu. And What's then the an darker antelope? one, that is the bongo. But before we get what into those antelopes, I do want to point out on the left hand side as well, that is a black rhinoceros. Where? Oh, they got a rhinoceros? Oh. Oh. What the I like hell? rhinoceros. Where the fuck do you get a rhinoceros from? Where do you find a rhinoceros? It is. Where's the good boy? He's the one in charge. He's the one nice and close to us on the right hand side, actually. Now, the bongos go full naturally dark as they came from that look like, charge. is that a reindeer? Bongos are most notable for their camouflage trees. They'll use it to their advantage by hiding in some of the darkest hey, and darkest boy. parts you of you the did. forest. Exactly. And both males and females do have those And we're also spotting a Nile hippo along the bank there. Whoa! They got hippos. Oh, yeah. <laughs> those pink-backed pelicans, they're Damn. for the color of their skin, <laughs> they not their feathers. Can be a little bit they're tricky to spot big the biggest during the mating season. It's one of those big hippos. I didn't even know they were real. I'm trying to tell you. To prove they know how to build the animals. For the Watusi oh, people who first is. domesticated them. Oh, they're actually one of only two is. domesticated animals that make their home oh, wow. out here on the reserve. And while they are livestock, is they're not bold? kept in the uh, traditional sense. They're not valued oh. for any sort of milk or medication known as hyena day. Oh, one of the biggest snap differences hyena. with canines hyena days. Like in the hyena's this. case, they're Dang. matriarchal. To such a degree that even the lowest ranked female hyena is still above the highest ranked male. Woo! <laughs> Most densely packed oh, humans. 
They're going to hang around with about 1.5 million others at a time, and they are a migratory species. For the wildebeest, what that means is each year they're going to pack up all 1.5 million of their friends and travel between 500 and 1,000 miles in search of fresh vegetation. They track the rainfall patterns in order to achieve that, figuring out where the freshest food is tower. A tower of drafts, which is incredibly fitting since they do in fact tower over everyone else, being the tallest land mammal. Fully grown, they'll reach heights of around 18 to 20 feet tall. <laughs> It'll just grow and become tall. Tall. Range, tall. The average baby draft will start life at about 6 feet in height. There's one that looks like he might across the road, so I'm just hanging out, letting to see if he does. <laughs> no? Okay. <laughs> now, there's a lot of cool numbers we can talk about with giraffes, but I like their hearts. And fully grown, a giraffe's heart is going to be about the size of a chig, maybe even a little bit crazy. But it does also make sense. They have that really long neck. They need to be able to pump blood oh, all the way up to their brains. So along with a large heart, they come with oh, the God. highest blood pressure of any Hey, bro, when you look at animals, they look well, so much. Like, yeah. inside, there's this large look, tan color. Oh, so oh man. Sure I don't really know how to describe it. It looks crazy. Do you notice their coats? They're very shiny, very oily. Oh, that's they hard. are pretty oily creatures. But that actually helps them because when they do stampede, What's they tend to run into each other. That's actually where the confusion name comes from. So that oil is a constant transfer between each wildebeest. But another fun thing to do is take a peek at their ears because those big African elephant ears are roughly shaped. They got they African 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 African. African. And they do serve a purpose. There's actually a couple of them right now demonstrating bingos of flamboyance. And the greater flamingos, they are the largest and tallest species of flamingo. Not quite the brightest in pink color, though. Oh. It's actually going to be the lesser oh. flamingo. Uh oh. Uh oh. Sorry about that. I'm not quite sure what that was. Uh -uh. Cheetahs, they're not winning any at marathons. They are sprinters. They can only maintain that speed for a couple hundred yards, about the length of three football fields. What? And after that sprint, they require quite a lengthy rest period. So they're only going to go all out at their tops for their Thank you. Yeah. I ain't going to lie to you, boy. Corn. Hey, corn. Oh. <laughs> I got a fruit cup. That fruit cup? This shit hit me. What the fuck? Oh. Yeah. Wait, I thought this was supposed to be the, the cartoon. What the hell is this? <laughs> what the? What is this? <laughs> One stormy night long ago, ah, yeah. steadily through an elevator. Oh, we going on high? No, 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 no. no. Are they on a roller coaster? Oh shit. It's over. This time, it's open for you. What the fuck? It's like doing a roller coaster. <laughs> Which one is this? He said this was the same city. <laughs>
Why roller coasters? It's just like the, the when you get to the big drop, when the big drop come up. And I ain't talking about the big drop. I don't think I'm talking about. Oh, I'm not talking about that. <laughs> I'm talking about a roller coaster. Damn. See that right there? Oh, no, that wasn't it. That was a mini drop. That's about to be crazy. No, they don't look like that scary. I can't record this one, but yeah, this is a new ride. I panic as a ride. Look at Buddy. He ain't even moving. That's crazy. Uh oh. The ride was lit, man. It was turnt. It's probably the best ride here, I ain't gonna lie. It's a new ride. Ain't nobody really be on it for real because they ain't open it to the public yet. Well, they got no be out. Yeah, I get on that ride. It's a cheap ride. Uh, I don't know how the rest of it go, though. I ain't never seen this in person before. It was hard. It's so pretty. See how everyone waits for the fireworks? Mm -hmm. Lamb chops. Lamb chops. Hey, I ain't had lamb chops in it. New clip, new location, man. Hey, Swish, you know? It is Halle birthday and we in Jamaica. Oh, happy birthday. My first time here. I never been to Jamaica before, but every monitor will blood clack guy. Bullet. You go up here. Bullet. No thank you. I'm get your ass whooped out here, man. I'm fresh off the plane, bro. Jamaica man. Yeah, clean one of you niggas out here. Nice one. I don't see one cloud out here, man. Y'all living right. Got dub in here. <laughs> dub. That nigga dub everywhere. <laughs> Real nice that nigga here, dub man. everywhere, dog. He international with it. Let me take an hour to get here from Florida. About to be here for a little bit. Have a good time, man. I'm about to get lit. I'm about to find the weed. <laughs> No, yeah, I got the gas out here. The, the tropical. Yeah, I got the tropical gas out here. Let's see this popping shit. Um, so if any Jamaican floods watching this right now, hit me up. You was the ganja man. Yo, 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 blow the ganja. Niggas, whoa. That man whipping that boat. <laughs> he whipping it, man. The hours of 8.30 and 4 o'clock, alright? Okay. You have the option of getting paddleboard yeah, higher to the room as well anytime between 8.30 and 4 o'clock. But yeah, that's ma. just in case the weather permits. We have a green flag out now, so that means all water spread activities are able to go out. If it turns yellow, it's diving, sailing, and higher on the river. Where we do have a Exotic Rendivious. Oh. Location. Ron oh hell shit. <laughs> Exotic rendezvous. Damn. Exotic rendezvous? Location for the adventurous clothing optional beach. <laughs> Whoa. Hey man, what type of freaky shit y'all got going on in Jamaica, man? 
That nigga some freaky Jamaica freaks in Jamaica. Lady, you know. It's crazy. Y'all waiting on the room to get finished. I landed hella early. Got to kick it, chill. Ain't got no plans today. Just relaxing. Probably gonna do a bunch of activities and shit. I'm gonna try to vlog for y'all. Um, you know, I ain't posting, been posting in a minute, so I'm a little rusty with the vlog and shit, but you know, I'm doing what I can. But nah, it's gonna be lit. A nice adventurous day on the way, man. Real nice, mad light button. This is Jamaican breakfast. Aki and something else. I don't know what it is. But it's supposed to be good. I'm going to try it. Try it for y'all and shit. Let's see what they talking about here, man. Bomber clap. <laughs> Bomber clap. This is my friend right here, man. I gave him a piece of bread and he just being nice and polite and waiting. Just waiting. He trying to act like I don't see him. I can see you, nigga. Just ask. All you gotta do is ask. Go ahead, throw him a little something. I'm trying to throw it as far as I can. That nigga <clears> said a little something. That's a whole piece of bread. <sighs> He was waiting too. Oh, shit. He about to steal that bitch. Oh, no. They oh, about to get the squall in. Shit. They getting the squall in. No. no bread, though. They gonna come in. They gonna come in now. Oh, they done brought the gang, gang. Oh. Look what he done did. I ain't got nothing for the whole gang, man. I ain't have it. I ain't had enough for your man. You gotta ask your man to get you some, bro. <laughs> nah. Ask your man's, man. <laughs> That's crazy. They around us now, look. Why did he do that? They going crazy. You messed up. Look, there you go. You gotta tell them to leave, bro. If I give you some more, you gotta tell them to leave. <laughs> you can't just. Up, that's what I'm saying. You they lined up in a row. You gotta tell your peoples to leave, bro. I ain't giving you no bro, more. Why day. did he do that? Why the hell you keep showing people what I give you? Bro, why did he do that? He got all them birds that's the just last around one. around him. Oh, yeah, MTV Cribs. Okay. Why does nigga open the door like that? Let me start that. Nigga said you came from Bomber Clock, dude. Alright, let me do it. Good job, man. Welcome to the hot. To the speezy. You gotta do a proper introduction. Oh, they got the champagne. They got the champagne. This is a multi million dollar house on the water. And you can see from the title, man, you know, something like easy. Yeah. As soon as I popped in, I felt like I had to pop a bottle. You know what I mean? Pop the bottle down, right? A little bit of champagne, nothing but a little thing. You feel me? Like how I'm living these days. Cool, fresh fruit. And you serve at home. Yeah. Yeah. Let's do it. Uh, I'm going to go in there. got the water. Like I said, I'm going to show you how it's really real. This right here, it's a million dollar uh, statue right here. Okay. Y'all don't even know. I got this shit. That comes a meal? Yeah. I almost want this shit to feel like home. Yeah. It's reminding me of like trees and gold at the same time. Just something that's really artistic. Okay. That okay. makes a lot of sense. Come over here. You got, you got the um, nice little bed put together. 
Oh, and is that the same room that the that, that, that the beat drop was in? We're already on the point of line. Pick this. Yeah, yeah, on the water like Drake said. Last flow. Nice and cold. Oh, and he got the Gucci. Okay. It's gonna light up. You see all the fishes on and stuff. It's gonna he got the water on white like seven in the water. That makes sense. That makes sense. But uh, how you get in the same room as the beat drop, drop man? Toilet. Right here, the way I sound like I'm glazing the big drop. I, I got I don't want it to all be in the same place. I'm gonna kind of mess the head up. So I'm gonna put is this nigga tank top on the backwards first? I'm gonna put a toilet in here and I'm gonna throw a shower in here. So you can look, see toilet in here. Yeah, I'm gonna shower in here. And then you come over here and you got the shower. Check out the shower right here. And then you probably like, damn, where the tub at? I told you I wanted to use different rooms. Let me go ahead and put a tub in this bitch. Yeah. See, you know what I mean? Okay. Okay. That's a tight tub. tub it's a tub. I want to get creative with it. I'm like, damn. Like, I want to fuck around and be able to be in the sun while I'm soaking in the tub and getting right and getting good, you know, getting cleaned up and stuff. And then after that, I'm like, you know what? Then I'm going to have a little sunroof, hop in the tub, cool vibes. Then you can walk back out this way. Walk back out this way and you outside. Yeah. Like. This nigga calling the birds again, man. That's his problem, bro. I always calling the birds. Struggling. See y'all on the next one.